guys, Brody here. Welcome back to House Super. Here we are for part number 39, or Daddy Daycare part number 2. Uh, what we're going to do is smash all these walls down, get ready to expand, um, and open the place up a little bit. I'm still not sure um, where I'm going to put the bathroom. I mean, we could kind of still We'll leave it here, so that way we sort of come into the bathroom. We're gonna go through the bathroom to get to the bedroom, I mean, which isn't that bad an idea. It's probably not ideal for most people, but um, there's not really anywhere else we can put a decent bathroom for the owners and for them to have somewhere to go other than just to the toilet, like um, the kids' bathroom. Um, I mean, like over here, we could probably put in a little bathroom, but even then, that window kind of. It's just the windows. The windows are what? It's making it hard to move the bathroom. So we can't really move the windows. Well, I shouldn't say we can't really, we, we just flat out can't move the, window, the windows. Ah, so we're out of luck with that concern. So I think we might. Um, just leave the bathroom where it is, I guess. Let's continue just to smash these things down. My god, what a clutter! I don't know why you're worried, you know, it's always going to get cleaned up. Um, so... And I think that'll be the way to go. We really don't have one anywhere else to, um, put the bathroom really um, I do feel like though we could possibly expand it a little bit like that and then uh, knock these other ones down just expand it that little bit so we've got a little bit more room Yeah, I guess we could, and then we could, I think we could put a door on the other side, but I think we probably should leave the door like here somewhere. So we'll put um, one there, three, and then one, which is the width of the doors, and then you there. Um, that'll work. What is that? Oh, that's that thing off the wall. Okay, you're there as well. So that can be the bathroom, that can be the bedroom. Um, let's have a look at our paints. We'll go with the bright lavender, just to kind of match the bed. I want to go with like a modern slash rustic style home, I guess. that will do, we'll just go into white, it's going to be, you know, like a feature wall and then white the rest of the way, that's probably how most modern homes are, well, actually, I know when I built my uh, brand new house, all I got was white walls, didn't even get a feature wall, but um, for a lot of the people when they do actually build new homes and that sort of thing, they do just put in feature walls, one colour throughout the whole house, and then feature walls here and there, so I'll get rid of you, can move you out to there. So let's finish this bedroom before we go too much further. Uh, so I want like a rustic style. Um, golden metal, why not? There's still not much room in here, is there? Both on, they both work, good. Um, need to go curtains and blinds, we'll have them closed. We can't put any blinds up though because of where that wall is, which is fine. A lot of um, new houses as well, well, when you build a new house, you don't even get curtains and blinds unless you get a certain package, but they don't give you blinds, they just give you curtains anyway, so 
that will work. Um, pictures and paintings, go with this one. Just because it kind of matches uh, what's going on. There's like very limited, there'll be limited storage in here too. Just trying to work out what we can fit there, cupboard wise. There's really not much. Oh, maybe this one. What's Maroque? Brown. Ooh. African pear. Alder, pine, beach. Um, is that kind of. That's not far off. Um, the lounge, or the lounge, the bed, I should say. Uh, one more, not there. That'll work. Is it ideal? Uh, probably not, but at least they've got some storage. I can't put nothing on there though. I hate that. I really do hate that. Alright, so doors. Did we go with... Well, they were white doors, weren't they? No, they were this colour. Um, which way is the lock? Other way. Come into the bedroom. A little bit of storage. Um, I was thinking, I don't know if this will fit. Not with those. We could even put one over here. Like a TV. Probably not going to work though. Probably just leave it empty. Um, here we go. I think that'll do. Let's go. Should we carpet it or not? I mean, like most modern homes, everything's carpeted, so why not? Right, that's that done. Let's come through to here. Um, I was thinking of a shower in that corner. Let's see if we can get a bath in too. I don't know if we'll be able to though. There. Uh, bathtub. There. Let's see if we can get it in. It'd be cool if we can get both in there. That'll be awesome. Okay. Bathroom. Shower. Yes. Can we get a bath? No. Of course we can't. Too close to the wall, probably. Right, let's go installations. No, it's going to hit the shower. About this way. Nope, not going to. Not going to fit. Oh well. A shower is better than nothing. We really do need a um, shower bath combo though. I know they're working on the garden DLC, which I've now been told, or have since found out, it's not out till 2019, which is a little bit frustrating because we've so many homes that we've built ready for the garden DLC, which are just going to sit there. So we really need to, um, I guess, sell them. Let's continue to make as much money as we can and then come back and revisit and redesign some new homes once Garden DLC's out. So I'll put this in this corner. I think we'll put the toilet. Um... I don't know. That'll be a perfect spot for a sink. I don't know about a toilet. The toilet will probably go here. Installation, toilet. Right in the middle of the window? Nah, not like that. Uh, there. Let's go with a normal toilet. And put the um, sink in the other corner. So installation sink. Maybe in the center of this wall. Go 
go back into here, and we'll go with the rustic, rustic but sort of modern. Luckily, we've got it turned off now, so we, so we don't end up with water bloody everywhere. There we go. That'll work. Let's go into others and then mirror. Single white mirror. Uh, let's go hang up shelf white. Let's go one there, maybe. Another one there. That'll work, let's go uh, laundry basket. So for lights and darks. Uh, what are we going to put there? I would like like an open face sort of cupboard, but I don't think we really have one. That's that small anyway. Something like that, but like, you know, like just four cubes, like those bottom left four ones would be pretty cool. Um, how about that? That's kind of rustic, isn't it? That'll do. Let's go other. We can go... A couple of you in there. Survival. Toilet paper there. Um, we'll go other books. Yeah, I don't think we can get another one on top of that one, can we? Yeah, we can. Beautiful. A couple of books in there. That'll work. Go to bathroom before we forget, which is what I always forget. I need somewhere to put the poo paper. There we go. And over here, we'll just go. Uh, some candles. I'll go buy many. There we go. Buy small ones, single ones. That'll work. If we go into vases. Uh, something like that. Black one. Grab some white ones up the top here. There we go with magenta one. Um, what about you? You can go there and we go into plants. That there. Beautiful. That'll help us fill it out a little bit. Right, so we'll go with some floor tiles. So I want it to be modern but rustic, but I mean, just white is pretty cool. Will work. Um, where are we? Wall tiles. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Let's go those. We only need one. We'll go there and there. This is like a feature tile. And then we'll just go just like a white. So modern slash rustic, I guess, like that feature tile there is probably a little bit rustic. Sink's rustic. The vase sort of looks old school. What do you auto saves? I guess it's a good thing in case the game decides to die. Alright, 
So hopefully you guys liked um, Daddy Daycare Part 1. I'm recording this before it's been released, but um, yeah, I think it was a lot of fun. And I do have a pretty strong feeling that a lot of you guys are going to enjoy that one. I'm still sort of still waiting for Garden DLC. It's not till next year now, which is a little bit frustrating, but from what I've seen, um, it's going to be pretty amazing. It's going to be like a whole nother another half of the game I reckon it's gonna add like a whole nother another dimension to the current game and give us a lot of stuff to do outside we're gonna be able to put items outside from what I've seen um, with a few photos that house have released on Facebook um, there's like dog kennels there's outdoor like umbrellas and like lazy chairs um, or I guess you call them like deck chairs beach chairs whatever you want to call them so it's gonna it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna unlock a whole new new potential for us to have a lot more fun with and just to expand or extend the life of the game. Like a lot of um, current YouTubers that were doing House Flipper have kind of just stopped. So very few people still doing House Flipper on YouTube. Well, I mean, there's probably a lot of people doing it, but a lot of um, those successful YouTubers. There's very few of those guys doing House Flipper anymore. Um, am I one of those successful YouTubers? I'd like to think so. Like I've got just over 3,000 subs and more than I ever thought. So I would like to class myself as a successful YouTuber. Not as successful as most, but successful enough for me. Alright, there we go. Did we put... We haven't put ceiling lights in here yet. Alright. It's completely the wrong spot. Um, we'll go with a standard light switch. But we'll turn those off as well because we don't need them on now. We're not in there. Um, we're going to need you over here. We'll go with sconces. Why not? One there, maybe one, no, maybe one like over here or something. Should brighten it up enough. We'll go and put in another one of you here because when you come in from the bedroom, so that seems to brighten it up enough. Let's go. What am I thinking? Curtains and blinds. We go manual short narrow. We can. All right. So, what color do we want? Brown or like a grill? I'd like it brown stripes. Now let's go dark brown, just to match that feature tile. Well, even though it's probably a lot darker than the feature tile, but yeah, we we'll kind of help match. Let's look at um. Some carpets. I don't think we've got no like a brownie colour patterned. Um, we don't want granny carpet. One of these things we can't change colours on, which is a little bit annoying. That rustic, yeah, it's rustic. That'll do, I think. Right, there we go. Bathroom done. All right, where's our doors? There we go. So that's that done. Now I'm thinking um, kitchen up here. How many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. So there. All right. Um, oop, what am I doing? Wrong button. What is going on here? Hey. Oh. Oh, interesting. All right, so five. 
to a five. Uh, where are we? Five. I think that's like ten, so fifteen maybe. I'm trying to work out where the middle is. That's possibly the middle there. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, so that'll be six. Knock you down. If you want to, we probably go another couple. One on either side. Smack you. Come on. There we go. So this will be the kitchen side. This will be the lounge room and maybe dining room up this corner. So I do have a pitcher um, that I do want to use. Just have to wait for it to load in. It's just going to take a little while. Come on. It always takes forever, this does. So frustrating. Right, there we go. Let's go down. Now I need to find where it is. Um, it's not you. Beach, kids, Breaking Bad, cars, Chelsea, uh, Daddy Daycare. It's that. But I obviously haven't done what I wanted to do to it yet. Silly me. So, that was what I wanted to use. Put like a modern fireplace in, but. In which won't hurt too bad, I guess. We can probably um, go cupboards, TV. Hmm, white. Let's go there. Let's lift you up. Just to cover that sign. And then a TV above it. That's what I wanted, but I kind of messed it up a little bit with having that modern flames thing there. We can't cover that. I Man, I don't mind looking at that. Like that brick around the outside is pretty cool. We'll just have to get rid of those um, those words there. So, fireplace there. That's what I wanted. Right, get you out of the way. Uh, we're going to look at a sofa. So, as I said, like a modern... Modern but rustic, which... I feel like that's pretty... Like a modern like leather, but it still looks pretty rustic. Um, black with flowers, no. Red leather. We go with red leather. Let's have a look. Is that going to leave enough room for a table? Probably will. We'll probably just move it forward a smidgen. Might need to worry about a coffee table, but we'll go carpets. Single, single coloured, red. Something like that there, and then we can put like our dining table back here, which I know it's a fair walk from um, where we are, but that's fine. So classic dining table. We'll just go white, I think. We'll go chairs. We do have like a classic dining chair, don't we? classic chair with a cushion which is definitely what we want it's nothing worse than sitting at a dinner table 
on a bloody chair that has no cushion, you end up with a sore butt. And we can't have that. We cannot have that. Um, I think we're going to need to have it out a little bit. Is that because I'm in the way? I think so. How's that? It's not too bad. A little bit of room. Probably not a massive amount, but there's enough. Um, I don't think there was anything else that I downloaded. Let's see our daddy daycare photos. Um, to put in here. I don't think so, no. But I do like that one. Which has got that white thing at the bottom still. Hmm. Maybe not. Might go with some of these. Um, where are we going to go? About there. And I don't know if these things are even that important, to be honest, getting these sorts of photos in, but... Oh, God damn, I hate it when it does that. Point four. You there, we'll go. You just there. I'll try and help fill out these walls a little bit. Ah, something like this. Let's go. 1.25. That's upside down. Yeah, I think so. I think that's the right way. Boom, there, let's go. Um, cupboards again. Have we got anything? The old school TV cabinet, which I don't want. That, we can put that like kind of in the center of the wall. The center of the picture. There. No, to the right. One. There. Yep, that's better. Alright, so that's that done. We want a classic kitchen, which is. Um, and I'd like this one, but I don't think, because of the windows, it's going to work. Definitely not, unfortunately. Uh, kitchen set with the oven. Is that, that's that really big one, isn't it? Um, how about that? That could probably go there. I definitely want um, like one of these. Whether it's that one, which is it says it's got an oven in it, but I don't, I don't really don't like the looks of that. It's probably better. What colour though? Nut, white, dark oak, or chestnut? Let's go dark oak. Handles white, ornament white. Um, right. There. That's not that bad. Let's go. Right, so this is probably not the best. And then I think even with um, that, like that's not going to fit. Nah, not even close. I think that's all right. That'll be fine. Um, kitchen. Um, all white. That 
corner. Let's go one of these. Probably should have went by many, but anyway. Uh, one of these. Um, I don't want a big one there. I want like another one of those small ones. This one. There, there we go with a sink. Let's go white and grey, about white. White, white, white. Everything's white. You there. Can we get, can we get one of these? Boom. What about a fridge? That's the other thing. Maybe we need a fridge in there instead of that. Um, orange, green, brown. It's kind of old school, isn't it? Kind of helps stand out a little bit. So that's like living room or kitchen at. So we've got the kitchen in there, we've got the living room, dining room, um, we don't really have anything there. Um, where are we? Bookcase, wood cherry, grey, uh, bench. Let's go bench. Kind of just fill that wall out a little bit. So here, wall tiles. How will that go? That's probably that's not even the same tile that I had in there. It's all the one I wanted. Um, that one. That's the one I wanted. So feature tile. See, and that probably would have been um, perfect to go around the other side as well, but. Might not work now. It's because I've got that. Yeah, it probably won't work. Alright. That'll do for there. Um, grab some paint. I think just white. All along here. It's fine. We'll do like a red feature wall somewhere in the lounge room. Maybe above the fireplace. They should all be painted. They are. Beautiful. So auto save again. I reckon that red would be pretty cool. Where are we? No, not plants or paints. It's more of a brown than a red, isn't it? Whereas that is like probably way too red. No, that's not too bad actually. Yeah, that'll work. Right, we've got to try not to forget our extra appliances in here. Gonna try and put in some plants as well. Only a few, not too many. I know certain people hate the fact that I use a ton of plants at times, but I do feel like we definitely need more. And once a garden DLC comes out, hopefully they're gonna give us more interior plants too. That'll be um awesome. Ah, it's empty already. Oh, what? You said they just said what a clean home, and then they're dropping down the list. Do you want a dirty home? Ah, God. People just don't know what they want, do they? Let's 
Need to look at some curtains as well and some blinds. Definitely going to auction this house off though and sell it because that, as I said, I was trying to wait for the garden DLC and it's just going to take us too long. Too long to wait. Like 2019, some like quarter one they said, so it could be March next year, which is. I really hope it's not that far away, but it could be. It'd be annoying if it was. So long to wait. So exciting. So many people excited about it. And we don't want to be waiting until then. It's all done. Check all the walls, make sure. Yep, all good. Right, so we need a door for the back of the house. Uh, which way? No, other way. Back door. So that's all pretty good. Pretty well done. Alright, get rid of you. You want to go... Um, I know that's probably a silly idea. Uh, where are we? DVD player. One there. One there. Need a boom boom. Boom boom. Kind of sticks out a little bit. That'll work though. Ah, uh, that's that done. Let's go. Definitely want a clock up above the TV. Uh, we want a bin out there as well. Fit in that corner. We want to. That looks. They look weird, those countertops. They do look weird. Ah, uh, wood. Let's go Venge. And where's the other one? Can we fit it in? Yep, beautiful. Go with our electronics and grab our microwave. Stick it right in the corner that time. Um, coffee maker. Go there. Um, others. Teapot. Because it's old school. Um, knife stand. Where is it's a fork? There we go. Cutting board. And our knife. Yeah, beautiful. Right, so I'm thinking up in here. Steel. Uh, let's go black. How's that going to go? That's pretty cool. Right, now let's hope have they fixed this problem. But they all work. Yeah, beautiful they have. So that'll brighten that up a little bit. Um, as far as the flooring goes, I think the flooring's alright. Let's um, bring in some lining into here. Alright, we'll move that one to the right of the smidgen. And in here we'll um, 
mainly put it above the table. And not stress too much about um, like the lounge room area. There's nothing worse than having light in your eyes. Be good to get those flames to look a little bit more realistic, but I think that's pretty much done. Like I'm not going to stress. No, I think we need some more lights. As much as I don't really want to. Alright, put you there. Try and line them up. There we go. Let's help brighten that up just that little bit more. Uh, I'm not going to put anything in there. Just leave it empty. Uh, main front door. There we go. Walk straight in. Alright, time for some plants. One of you over there. Um, don't really need one there. Probably put in Monstera. Try and work out. It's kind of hard to get it to put in, get put in the right spot. So there, I think we might go with. Ah, that way. Mirror that way. That'll work. Um, plants, fern, in the middle of the table. Just need it to make it just look that little bit different. Right, so we'll go curtains and blinds now. We'll go get all these put in. So I'm done. The camera going crazy. Um, curtains wide and short. Red. That's probably going to cover those paintings, isn't it? Ah, just a little bit. It's not too bad. So narrow and short. Silk red. What's the difference between red and silk red? Oh, Jesus. They're the same? Yeah, they're the same. It's fine. Like that one, and we'll go wide. Just red. Um, and the blinds. And again, do we do we want red curtains out here, or do we want brown ones? To kind of match the fridge. Short, wide. Brown. Uh, brown. I reckon that'll be better than having red. Definitely better than having red in here. So I like the lights and the sconces and stuff, but just the way it shines, like it. That is weird. That shouldn't be shining like that. There's not really any light down here, so let's go. Just to lighten that up so that way no one trips over walking around. Um, I think, yeah, let's do it. Let's maybe just put like one there. That'll do. Right, I think that's it. I think we're done. Let's, um,. Go back through and have a look at the bedroom, bathroom, 
and the lounge room. I reckon it's pretty cool. Let's um go over this side and have a look at. There you go. Beautiful screenshot. So that's done. Modern, kind of rustic, kind of kitchen. Land room. It's a modern leather, but like a rustic looking L shaped kitchen or backwards L shaped kitchen. Oh, uh, kitchen, sofa. Old school chairs and table. Just modern, some modern pictures, modern painting. Reasonably modern kitchen, except for this part. You know, so, like a classic modern. Same as in here, like modern tiles, but classic cupboard. You know, classic bed size and that sort of stuff in there. So, I think it's turned out pretty good. Let's um turn these lights off. Let's go and have a look. A recap on the bathroom for the kids. We've got the little kitchen at the kitchenette area, small kitchen for the kids to make their lunches and breakfast and afternoon tea, morning tea, and then the kids play area through here, the daycare part. It's awesome. I really really like it. All right, let's go inside and let's sell it. I really don't want to sell it, but we have to. We could move our office here, but yeah, we won't. We'll sell it. We'll see what we get for it. So we bought it for eighty-two thousand. We've spent an absolute ton on it. So see how much money we make. Can we get up to say two hundred thousand on the sale price? That'd be pretty cool. Two hundred thousand would be great. One sixty-four or so we're getting there. One sixty-five expensive items in the house. We're not trying to rent it to people anyway. One seventy about the Gentarts. One seventy-two Veronica. One seventy-five the Smoth family, which one eighty would be perfect for them actually. Would be her little oh one hundred ninety-six for her daycare center. So two kitchens, yes. No big family room, no. And there's only. Like one bedroom, why would you guys move in? I don't get it. Alright, so let's negotiate offer. Let's go for like an extra 33. Ah, beautiful. Definitely worth it. 140 grand we made. That is awesome. Alrighty, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, as always, smash the like button, leave a comment, let me know what you did and didn't like. Um, every like and comment helps out the channel more than you guys realise. So if you want to help support the channel, please like and please comment. And if you're new to the channel and want to stick around and see some more House Slipper, hit that subscribe button. It's been Brito. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.